have you start with an opening statement, then take questions for the players only, and then questions for coach once the players go shower up. Probably one of our uh, best games of the year in terms of 40 minutes. With great focus. Um, thought the kids really knew the scouting. I think they were focused. They played hard with energy. Every time Loyola made a run, I think our guys were up for it. Made a big play. Uh, good poise. I thought Rakeem uh, Brookins ran the team well in the second half. Obviously, uh, Owen, Ryan, Odie uh, made big plays. Kyle Downey played great. We, we got a really good effort from a lot of guys tonight. It was a great win for the kids. I'm really happy for them and uh, give us a lot of confidence going into Sunday. Well, how well, you be able to win a game and win it comfortably? Uh, how's it feel, Ryan? Um, you know, it's definitely it's definitely good to finally get out there, you know, not not have to be so alert for the last couple of minutes of the game. You can kind of just take your time knowing as long as we have good possessions, we'll, you know, hold our lead. And, you know, like Coach said, they made a couple of runs, but we never, we never got it, uh, never allowed it to be below ten. Once again, no tape on the hand. Uh, all when you were hitting the threes again. I mean, uh, talk about your shooting in the first half. Did you, were you just, did you feel comfortable up there? Did yeah, you, uh, yeah, uh, yeah. I felt good, and uh, you know, I was getting open looks, so I was just taking them. And you know, I thought they were good shots. You know, they weren't um, too contested, and just you know, it was they were good shots. You seem to really take the loss hard against Ryder personally. Um, how does it feel to turn a few days later and get a really nice road it's, win? It's good, you know. I thought we um, we really got after him at the beginning of the game, and that's what I think we got to do now more moving forward. Is this team a little bit hard to figure out? <laughs> it seems like you guys are so up and down or erratic. I mean, do you, uh, you guys really figure yourselves out? Yet? I think so, but um, you know, we're just still trying to play hard every day and just get better, and hopefully, you know, we can, you know, do well towards the end of the season. Some of you guys did a really good job of trying to push the basketball. Was that kind of the plan going in? Yeah, I think so. Um, you know, we, we worked a great deal in practice on handling that press, and we knew once we get it past the first line of defense in that press, we'd have an advantage. And we did a very good job of that. We were able to uh, skip it over and then get you know three on twos, two on ones, and really attack the rim. We made our free throws, which is big. Um, you used to go to the shot uh, below the belt. Uh, what happened there exactly? Um, I don't, I don't know. He, uh, I think, uh, it's a new way to uh, play defense, maybe or something. I don't think I'm going to personally try that out, but, uh, you know, it's up to him how he wants to play, and that's what he has to do. That's what he has to do. Who's Walker? Uh, I believe so. Okay. Um, can you get – I know it's five minutes after the game. Can you get a sense on how big how big a win this is to just sort of uh, – um, in, the, in the standings or anywhere else? And just yeah. That in the you league. know, it's very important. Uh, we're right there with Loyola. I think we're a game back from them now. And, uh, you know, every, everyone's important. We don't want to come out, win this one, and then go out on Sunday and, you know, blow against Niagara, who's, you know, down there in the, in the standings. So we got to start putting together, you know, a couple of good wins and, uh, you know, get hot for the end of the end of the season. Did it seem like you weren't getting doubled as much as you had in points early in the season? Uh, yeah, I think so. I think um, – they, they kind of just tried to play me a little more physical on the post and have the help side there, but, you know, never really a full-out double team. And, um, you know, the guys had great spacing when they did double out we really hit shots. And, uh, I mean, all five stars were in double figures tonight, so everyone really played well, equally. Talk a little bit about your defense. You moved into four points over a long stretch in the first half. What was working for you? Not um, working for them? I think we, we were very, very active, and we talked a lot. When, you know, when we're out there talking, moving our arms, our defense is tough. We got a lot of height in our, in our lineup. And um, a lot of good athletes. So once we're out there and you know we're calling where shooters are, who's cutting through, we get active. We're very good. Our problem is sometimes we just you know we don't talk, and that's you know that's we're, that's when we give up points. At one point, I think you had like four points, Ryan, but you guys were up like sixteen. How nice is it that you didn't have to be scoring a lot and you still were able to kind of jump on? Them? Oh, I mean that's just a, a, a um, you know a testament to what we have in our lineup. You know, uh, Odie went for sixteen tonight. Uh, Owen went have uh, fourteen. Downing 13 and Rock 11. We got a bunch of guys that could score the ball. It's just a matter of what they gave us. And uh, today, transition really was a big key to our offense, and that allowed him to get out there and nobody to really get out there. Yeah, after the two terrible shooting games against St. Peter's and Ryder, what was the difference in you guys shooting the ball so much better? Do you think this? Time? Um, I think you know we just um, we had confidence tonight. And, you know, we, uh, they were open looks. You know, we weren't rushing anything, anything, and we just you know we took it at it. Anything else for the student athletes? Yeah. Thanks, guys. Any questions for Mitch now? You talk, do you like the way your team push the basketball? Or yeah, very got much so. that? I think that got us, uh, I thought that got us the lead, actually. I mean, we, we pushed it and got some easy baskets. But I, I think what keyed everything was our defense. Um, we really played a good zone today. I think we, we were active. We had guys talking. And we played the zone well at times this year, Mark, you know what I mean, in some games. And I think this was one of the games we played it really well. And that, that got us out. You know, we, would get, we were breaking out of the zone, which was good. What were you able to really take away from them with the zone defense? 
I, I think our guys, uh, <coughs> they were active, and we, we knew where the shooters were. I don't think they were getting, they got a couple of open looks. They're a good shooting team, you know, Hall and uh, Olsen. But they shot eight for 24, and I think that's a pretty good job on them. Um, the other thing we did is we were able to um, neutralize Walker a little bit. I mean, I don't know, uh, he was four for 12, 10 points. I mean, that's a good job on him. He's a good player. So I, I think we, with the zone, we were able to really get them a little bit out of sync. I've overcame. There was one play where I think he dove on the floor for a loose ball, passed the ball from his stomach. He was lying flat on his stomach to a, uh, on for a three-pointer. Did he just give you some energy? I'll tell you, Mark, he played well in the second half. I mean, he, when they hit cut it to 10, he made that play, a um, phenomenal play on, on, uh, on that drive. But that's his best he's played in, in, uh, in a while. I mean, he really looked like a senior player out there today, tonight in the second half. What does it mean for your team just to come off a couple of bad losses and win authoritative, win done? Authoritatively on the road against the team well, that's playing pretty well. It's a great win. I mean, uh, Loyola's just beaten uh, St. Peter's, Fairfield, Marist in the row. I mean, they they beat arguably the best team in the league here, you know, and, and we come down here and beat them by 17. So, a great win, Mark. It was a great win. Do you have trouble figuring this team out at times, Mitch? You know, you know, this team can look so good at times and so bad at other times. Uh, you know, I think I think we're getting better more. You know, I mean, I, I know we've had we've you know we've had some games where we haven't shot well, but the kids have played with effort all year, and I like the kids. I think they're great kids, and uh, you know, I'm really happy for them tonight. They really needed this. Last question. Oh, um, I'm sorry. Okay. Uh, Niagara, uh, how much you're looking for? You know, well, we got to be able to drum down. Beat us there. pretty handily at Niagara. We got to we got to be ready to go Sunday. I mean, it's not going to be easy. They get up for us and. Uh, you know, we got to be ready to go. It's going to be a tough game. Thanks, Coach. Thanks. Thank you. Thanks, Coach. Thank you.